Our event today is part of a worldwide campaign to stand up and speak out for the realization of the Millennium Goals. People are now assembling at their workplaces, colleges, schools throughout the world to take the Millennium Pledge and to demand action by world leaders. So I'd like to ask you all to help us break that world record. So let me now read the Millennium Pledge. The International Day for the Eradication on this symbolic day. The International Day for the Eradication of Poverty. To show our commitment to the fight against extreme poverty and inequality. We are standing because we refuse to accept more excuses in a world where 50,000 people die every day as a result of extreme poverty and the gap between rich and poor is getting wider. We are standing because we want our leaders to honour their promises to meet the Millennium Development Goals and we ask them in fact to exceed these goals. We join in solidarity with people from over 100 countries to say to the leaders of the wealthy countries, we urge you to keep your promises on poverty, debt cancellation, more and better aid, trade justice and gender equality. To the leaders of the poorer countries, make it your first responsibility to save the lives of your poorest citizens. We ask you to tackle inequality, to be accountable to your people, to govern fairly and justly, to fight corruption and to fulfill rights. Today and every day, we will stand up and speak out against poverty. We will continue the fight against poverty and inequality and hold our leaders to their promises. We are asking not for charity, but for justice. We are millions of voices standing in solidarity to say no more excuses. End poverty now. So join me now in the countdown, starting at 10. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, zero. Stand up. I would just like to thank you all for coming today and thank our guest speaker.